Hello, my name is Yalu and I am from healthcare professional background. So let me bring you through the journey of what Future Talk does and how we wish to save uh, the healthcare of Malaysia in the future. So among a few problems, if you've ever been to any government hospitals, realize that they actually still use filing systems, which means that they keep all your records in the file. And they have this one big file room where there's a lot of old records inside there. And sometimes we as doctors and nurses, we don't know where to find the files. Then the patient files went missing and all, then we'll be realizing, oh, what was the condition that the patient had previously? Imagine now that you are in an emergency situation or you go to the hospitals, but then we lose your files. Or we just misplace your files, so and so. All of these things happen. Then do you think you are getting the real proper care that you need? Not just that, let's say you want to go anywhere in Malaysia, let's say you're based in Samoa, and now you travel to Kedah, or you could just travel to Johor to, to for your work trip, but now you're feeling sick, then you go and see doctor. Then doctor asks, so what was your previous medications? What were your previous health conditions? What kind of things, surgeries you have done before? Uh, if you're not in professional uh, healthcare background, you may not exactly know the exact details of it. What if some things could be done for all these things? The second problem is if you ever have grandparents, parents, or even children, you know that in Malaysia, we are still very lacking much in terms of preventive care. And what I mean by this is that we only treat the diseases when we have it, but we don't try to prevent it in a sense. So like, let's say someone has chronic kidney disease, heart attacks, strokes, or even cancer. You know that it may be a bit too late to treat it when only you have it. A lot of things can be done to prevent all these things. And also, if you've been to government hospitals or clinics, you know that they are very crowded in the sense that for you to get a... Treatments, you have to wait four to five hours. And then for one appointment to the next appointment, it takes you up to six months and all those things. So therefore, we wish to provide you a solution. What if a lot of things could be done? See over here, it's just a QR code. So all your health information will be inside this QR code, which means that now, wherever that you go in Malaysia, so let's say I'm based in Sarawak, and now I go to Sabah and Sarawak. I was sick in Sarawak, so I just showed doctor this QR code. But then just scan this QR code, and then he will know what are the illnesses that I have in the past, what are the surgeries, what are the medications that I am taking. This will correct convenience for so many things. And not only that, you, know, you no longer have to get the file from Selangor, bring all the way to Sabah, and then show the doctor the file, and then bring all the way to Johor to show the doctor the file. No need. All you need is just a phone that everyone has, and then the QR code gives you everything, all the information that you need. Not just the QR code, we also have the app where if you're not feeling well, you can just see the doctor at the comfort of your home. Hello, doctor, how are you feeling? You can talk to your doctor while you're online. And let's say the doctor feels that you are okay, then they just send the medicine to your house. But let's say they feel that you need more treatments, then we'll provide the doctor to go to your house and treat you. And all these data are kept and synced to provide you the best AI analytics possible. Hopefully by the end of these years, we're able to come up with the first AI in diabetes. But of course, we know diabetes is the number one or number two killer in Malaysia. Therefore, by allowing you a personalized companion, it can help you to evaluate the risk that increase your risk of diabetes. And let's say you have diabetes, how do we reduce the risk of diabetes? And we're going to show you the prototype and also the app, the actual app that we have later. So you may ask, what is the market size in this? Let me tell you, the market size is super big. The total addressable market is 54.5 billion. But let's say you just be conservative and just taking 1% of University of Malaya Medical Center of just 10K, we will have the revenue of 12 million ringgit Malaysia in just one to two years duration. And our business model can be divided in B to B to C and so B to C. So for consultation, we just charge 15, in house treatment, charge 149. But for the AI, we only charge 99 ringgit per year. In terms of competitive analysis, we are still have we're still quite different in terms of our competitors in terms of the services that we provide. Therefore, we are quite unique. And also with the AI additions, this is going to be a big plus for us. Let me show you the prototype. Let me show it to my phone right now. Good day and welcome to the prototype. As you can see over here, this is the main home page of what we have. So let me bring you first to the profile. Over at the profile region, you can see that this is our patient's uh, user interface, Juliana, 9 years old. There, there is her height, her weight, her age, her allergies, any diseases that she has. And one amazing thing is that when you press the icon, it just shows you the QR code. Even that now wherever that she goes, she can just get this scan and then she can get all the information for the doctor to see. Like the past diagnosis we see that she had, over at the UMC Daily Center, NK Daily Center, what was her weight, what was her dry weight, what was the complications like shortness of breath, muscle cramp, all these things are possible. And she also able to see all her past medical histories like her grandfather, grandmother, all these things, like any of the complications that they had. And not just that, if you go over to the core region, you can always get connected to a doctor and then let the doctor to assess you essentially what is it that you're facing and all. 
and you just wait you get connected to the doctor now so you talk to the doctor hi doctor so and so i feel sick over the past few days i have fever i have friendly nose so what is it that i have the doctor will give you the medications and then the advice that you need then you can end the call and then you can go to the medications part and then you see what the medications that you need and any reminders like oh yeah you have an appointment with a dermatologist so and so then you can always see it over here over at the community region here is where you can get updated with the community discussions and all those things because we know that essentially all these things are it could be quite a tough journey so by having someone to go with you along the long way you can always get more motivated and all these things and then over this here you can also see the appointments and they can always set your appointment change the date if you need all those things the day and the time they say I want to change it to the 20th all these things are possible and then you also can see your uh, wheel more over here you can see these are all the health parameters that have been tracked so let's say I want to know more about my heart rate and all you can see this is a detailed analysis of your heart rate what's your lowest your highest of your heart rate all these user interface are made here very user friendly so that you can always see what they want to improve and then you can see here over the goals what was the exercise was it done or not how many percent are you towards achieving your goal and you also can see what are the nearest clinics, dialysis centers that are nearest to your house. Okay. And then you can see your diet planner. So all this is where the AI comes in and we are having all your information integrated and everything. We can see what the information and food that you really need to help you feel even better. Okay, and in the future we're gonna have the AI which allow you to scan you daily, analyze you to know what is it that you need to improve and allow some gamifications to really to tell you exactly how you are comparing with your friends to give the best. So this rough overview of the prototype, essentially this will allow people to go anywhere around the world and have all their information at the tip of their fingers without worrying so much. Let me show you the actual app that we have done also. See over my screen. So these are the actual apps that we have done. We have the patient app, Dr. M and ME app. So for today, I'll just show you the patient app because there are a lot of things to show you, okay? But time is in our limit. So you go here, here's your user interface. You can always key in what was your blood pressure, everything. You know, there are steps and then your today goes. You can search the doctors that you want. Let's say I want to see an ophthalmologist. I can always connect it to the doctor via a video call or not. After all, I can just via the chats and always chat with the doctors and all. And not only that, I can also set an appointment with the doctor on the date that I want, on the time that I want, all these things. And all these are actual apps we've coded by my friends. And then you have all these symptoms. You press your symptoms and then you submit. And you can see all the past history of your apps. And the doctor, when they see you, they can have a better understanding of what you have. You can always check your appointments, whether is it pending, is it confirmed, and what are the appointments that you have. And always your health records. And not only that, you can also see your past history, doctor visits. So I recently have seen her UM Ophthalmology Center and they, they, I had a fever associated with my eyes and then they gave me Panadol. And the doctor was treated has written me also and this is where my everything can be scanned and then I see all my past receipts so this is a rough brief overview then let's say if you have time in the future we'll show you more of it you can always scan this QR code to try out the prototype whenever that you need and it's not only that our app is actually done so how sustainable are we in the long run we have Unity Malaya Medical Center as our possible partners because I myself is from there and not only that we have managed to raise up to 30,000 so this can sustain us up to one to two years and not only that our app development is done as per shown you just now and we are really a highly capable team in the sense that we are people of various backgrounds we have more than five people in the team people of pharmacies, medicine all of those things and we are also the only team that make it to grand finals Malaysian team grand finals for the China Asian Smart City Innovation our sustainability, our sustainability roadmap in the long run is that we're going to furnish the app we're going to have up to 1,000 users we're going to collaborate with uh, many efficiencies and also in car streaming also many of the AI features that come along the way so this is how we have planned ahead of road to make sure that we are always staying ahead so the impact that you want to give is as you close your eyes right now I want to close your eyes and imagine the future that right now if you are sick you want to see a doctor you can do it at the touch of your fingers not only that let's say you want to go to any hospitals any clinics you don't have to worry you just go there bring your phone let the doctor scan the QR code then you have all your information at the tip of your finger not only that, you're going to have an AI personalized for you to tell you what you can do to improve your health at every single day. What a diet that can, you can change immediately, personalized to your levels. This is the impact that we future dog wish to give to you. Not only for you, but for your loved ones to make sure that all oh, you deserve what you need. And therefore, this is my team. I myself is from healthcare medical background, and I have a team from vastly management, bachelor of computer science, bachelor of finance, data science, pharmacy, and also many more. So therefore, this is actually what we future doc from Team Gobi or Goho wish to provide to you. So we wish that you have a good days, and we can make an impact in Malaysia's healthcare today and right now in our hand. Thank you.